The concept of marginal gains has been proven to have a huge impact in increasing productivity and output in a process that focuses on manageable incremental change as opposed to big changes. In this video, we look at 5 steps to getting the benefits of marginal gains. Number 1. Understand Marginal Gains Back in 2002, the British Olympic cycling team had no significant history of success, only having achieved one gold medal in its 76 year history. Thanks to the principles of marginal gains, in the Beijing Olympics in 2008, the British cycling team won 7 out of 10 gold medals available, and from there have gone on to winning 3 of the last 4 Tour de France competitions all based on a simple principle whereby the focus is to make small improvements in performance, rather than reinvent the wheel to try and revolutionise their way of working. Number 2. Focus on Kaizen Kaizen is an approach used in Japanese business, whereby the focus is to make continuous and small improvements rather than sweeping changes. This is done by identifying a number of areas where small improvements can be made within the business. The ideas for change come from those who work in those areas, rather than research and development, so that they are closer in understanding how these changes will impact them day to day. This idea leads to the next point on how to work towards marginal gains. Number 3. Take ownership and identify processes In both Kaizen and the idea of marginal gains, it's up to the individuals to try and take ownership and responsibility in their roles. That means to understand their role and processes in as much detail as possible, and spend time focusing on identifying areas that can be improved, made much more efficient or where there are possibilities for small improvements. The individual then needs to put together a list of areas for possible improvements, focusing on the small details. Number 4. Find Improvements once a list of areas to improve is collated, it's important to focus on how they can be improved. These will be small changes, which in the short term may not show immediate or significant gains, but over a period of time will compound to have a large impact. For example, for someone in a role where they type on a keyboard, they may explore the idea of learning to touch type. Initially, this may not show significant improvements in how quickly they type but when they add up the time saved in a day, a week or month, the time gained can be significant. Number 5. Continually seek improvement Once improvements are made, the key is to then continually review and improve the process, to keep getting gains of small changes, as the process is about incremental and continual growth, not just about immediate gain, but evolving over time. Continuing with the typing example, this might be to move from touch typing to exploring possibilities of speech to text, avoiding the need to type at all. So apply marginal gains in your work and life, as doing so could be the difference from being just another competitor to becoming an all time great. Thanks for watching, please like, share and subscribe as we help you live life on your terms. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to ensure YouTube notifies you of the latest uploads.